Hey guys, what's up? Hayden Plays MC here. Today I'm back with another video, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a bootable USB drive on Mac using um, an ISO that you burn onto it. So, we're going to start out with um, just simple USB, nothing on it. Um, make sure you guys don't have anything on it because the process will delete any files that you have on it. Just move everything off for the time being. Um, it is reversible, so you can just move the stuff back once you're done. So, anyways. All we're going to need is terminal, and we're going to need to put in uh, three commands, and then we'll be all good. So the first one is going to be disk util list. It's just going to tell you what disks are on. So for me, my USB is dev disk 2. Um, yours could be 3 or 1. Actually, probably not 1. Maybe 3, maybe 4, depending on if you have uh, another hard drive or another USB installed. So just make sure that you find the right USB drive that you want to use. So the next thing is going to be disk util unmount disk slash dev slash disk and you put the number of yours in so mine's two so I'm going to put two. It's going to say it's successful. And then the last command is going to be sudo dd if equals and then we need to put the path to where the file is. So mine is in my downloads so it's going to be users Peyton downloads so we're gonna put users Peyton downloads and then you need to put the file name that we're gonna burn on so I'm gonna burn on Arc Linux which is for the GPU fix if you guys have a bad GPU in your MacBook I will put the link to the video down below anyways we're gonna put Arc Linux dash 2017 dot 12 dot 01 dash x86 underscore 64 dot iso and then we're going to put of equals slash dev slash r disk and then your number again so mine's two so i'm going to put two and then space bs equals one m press enter it's going to ask you for your password just type that in and then it's going to start doing its thing this could take a couple minutes as it is mounting an iso onto usb to make it bootable so don't worry if it takes a couple minutes. Um, so I'll catch up with you guys once it finishes booting um, or putting the ISO onto it. It'll create a little pop-up. I'll show you guys what that looks like. All right, guys, I'm back. So this is what it's gonna look like. It's gonna come up with a little warning that says the disk you inserted was not readable. All you're gonna do is click on ignore, and then you can go about and reboot the computer, and all will be well. Um, if you want to undo the process at the end, all you're going to do is click on initialize and then it's going to bring this up and then you just click on um, erase and that will erase it and put it back to normal so that you can use it. But all you guys want to do is click on ignore and then you can come into Apple and you can click on restart or shut down and then you boot up holding option and it's going to pop up and that's all you have to do. So it's actually really simple, just three commands in terminal. It's completely reversible if you guys need to use the USB afterwards, but if you need to create a bootable USB drive, this is how you do it. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.